All right, so in the at the end of the last episode, I I died <laughs> and I lost a little bit of progress. So I decided to do some of that off screen. So as you can see, I'm on floor four now. I think I died on like floor two. I kind of just did floor three off screen. You didn't really miss much. Um, the only thing that really happened was Junpei learned uh, Gigantic Fist. I don't remember if he learned that at the at the end of last episode, but he did learn that. And uh, I also got a Maraku Kaja skill card, which is pretty nice. I might duplicate that. I don't know. We'll see. But other than that, that's about all that really happened. So we're gonna try and not die <laughs> stupidly. Gonna try and keep Igus' health up as much as possible. So yeah, uh, yesterday kind of sucked. <laughs> oh no, why are we starting with this, bro? Why are we starting like that? That is a really bad way to start this floor, bro. These guys are strong. Okay, let's use, um... Let's use Junpei Steergy, then. Yeah. Boom. Glad it still, glad it still heals him. I'm going to play it safe, and I'm gonna heal. <laughs> Please scan this guy. I want to know his weakness. He has no weakness. So, uh, you strike on it. Good. Good to know. So, in other words, gigantic fist. Just, just fist it back. When the beetles decide to fist you, you fist them back. Also, we both have- we all have gigantic fist. Ayo. I haven't seen you in ages. Yeah, I've been, uh, I've been busy, I guess you could say. <laughs> I was gonna play last night, but, uh, my internet decided to kill itself. <laughs> like, I've always been wanting to play party games with you. It's, it's so weird, late. Like, like, everybody's like, yeah, we should play these games, or, like, it's not just a you thing, but then nobody, like, pings me. Or if they do, it's always in the morning when I'm at work or at gym. And yeah. I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> it's like, I don't... Oh, but no, today was uh, chaotic, dude. You want to hear something funny? Sure, I mean, why not? not really funny, but more so strange. So, yesterday, uh, I was not at work because, you know, it was my day off. And my schedule every week is posted on Friday. Mm -hmm. I had texted my boss. I was like, hey, uh, when you get the chance, can you text me my schedule? All right, um, go yeah. through the whole day. Uh, my schedule was never texted to me. So it's like, that's fucking weird. So today <laughs> I was like, you know what? I, I am gonna take a lift ride to work and find out what's going on. You wanna know what I found out? What? My boss was fired. <laughs> Damn, <laughs> some crazy news. And, and I'm like, what? Yeah, oh yeah, Josh and Nicole, they all got fired and I'm like, Oh, that's why nobody sent me the schedule. And they're like, yeah. <laughs> and they're like, oh, here's your schedule, by the way. And I'm like, thanks. Like, what the uh, fuck happened that here? Some I'm, weird news. I'm like, bro, I've only been gone like two days, and already the boss is fired. <laughs> what the fuck? Yep, sorry, you're not. <laughs> you haven't been here. We're gonna fire your boss. Yeah, that's why I was so weirded out. I was like, what the fuck happened? Yeah, I'm gonna just, like I'm just fire people when they're away. <laughs> it's like that black guy with the pizza. You just walks in the room, sees it all on fire, and just walks out. Yeah, that's how I felt. I mean, yeah, I was just gonna, I was just talking about how my, uh, my internet decided to shut off randomly at, like, I think it was, like, in the af- it was, like, in the evening, and then it was off, like, the entire night, so I just couldn't do shit. It was annoying. 
Tell me you don't have Verizon. Hey, let's loot that no. That's not, I'm pretty sure that's an American uh, internet anyway. <laughs> But yeah, I was good. I like, like I was ready to play um, like New Super Mario Bros. with my with my boys, and like we were all we were all available that night too. And then I was like, bro, why why did my internet shut off at this time? It's like the worst possible day. It could have shut off. So See, like go see if no I can do it tonight. Ever, I know it's like nobody ever pings me for the cool shit anymore. <laughs> Everyone's like. Hey, are we gonna do this? And then I'm like, wait, I missed this shit? What? <laughs> well, probably, uh, I could probably invite you to Mario Party because uh, half the time nobody's fucking free for that shit. No, it's just like my one friend group, uh, they don't play as much anymore. And then the new friend group, uh, has been doing it quite often. Is one of those friend and groups Mario's group? No, I... I don't want to get into shit talking or ever. Just more so, uh, there was a falling out because he couldn't stop disrespecting my boyfriend. Oh. <laughs> Ooh, endure. Hmm. I don't have to get rid of for that, though. Eh, I guess I can get rid of Grove 3. And Light Boost, why not? I mean, yeah, they were they were playing Mario Party like yesterday, I think. Obviously, uh, I wasn't invited. Sad face. <laughs> I mean, I've always been wanting to do Mario 64 co-op uh, DX with you, and trust me, with the updates and all the ROM hacks that have been added, like, dude, there's a lot we could play. True. I've just not been in the mood for Mario 64 because I kind of I kind of played that a little too much. I kind of burnt myself out on it. So, no, this shit's I was my taking crack. a break from it. <laughs> this shit's my crack. Like, I've been constantly seeing updates. And recently, they're starting to import uh, Kaze's ROM hacks. And they're trying to import uh, Last Impact. Oh, yeah. I don't know why that hasn't been ported already. I've been waiting for that one. Uh, they already started development on it. And they have a beta version of it out. Well, see, that shit, that's something that should have been done, like, two years ago. <laughs> Cause I've been waiting on them to do that. No, the one ROM hack I've been, like, so desperate and been so wanting. Uh, I don't know if you ever heard it. It's called Mario on Indigo Island. Um, and sounds familiar. Saying, yeah. And the reason why that one is super cool, it's an open world Mario ROM hack. Oh, all rip and Luke went to go jack off. Okay, he didn't say anything. Weird. Yeah, the old, I only really know like the OG Mario 64 hacks. I mean, obviously there's there's Kaizo Mario 64, which I don't think anybody's gonna want to play that. Hey, here's the thing. Uh, one of my main issues with Kaizo ROM hacks. It's just, it feels less of, oh, I'm using vanilla skill set. And it's like, how can I fuck with the game and do glitches and exploits in order to achieve a lot of these uh, special tech? And it's just like, fuck that. Yeah, you see, in order to do this specific jump, you have to do a camera exploit glitch. And I'm like, yeah, no. Just let me do the vanilla moveset. And if I can make it, I can make it. Yeah. That's why it's always nice to play those ROM hacks that are like, oh, it feels like an extension to the main game. You know? Yeah. Where, like, you finish the vanilla game, and then it just increases the death that got from there. I think that's cool. Well, but just it basically it... feels more natural. <laughs> yeah. I will be defeated here. I, mean, I have Kaizo Mario 64, but again, I don't think anybody's gonna play that. Ooh. Nah, I don't need that. I can't believe there's 146 stars to collect in this uh, beta. Well, that's good. 
I mean, yeah, if, if whenever Last Impact does come out, I, I definitely want to play that. I'll, I'll get it everybody is out together. Already. It's just not fully finished. Well, then I want oh, it to be shit. finished. <laughs> yep. Great. Once it's actually finished, then I'll play it. You know? Just like how Project 06 technically isn't finished yet. How long has Project 06 been in development? Like, I swear, at least like four or five years. I mean, sure, you know, Sonic Shadow and Silver's levels are all playable, but I still want to see the final story, as well as, uh, you know, cutscenes and bosses and stuff. You know, for all the shit talking about your sex, uh, I mean, Sonic 06 gets, you gotta admit one thing that was interesting. What? Mephilus succeeded in what no other Sonic villain actually did. <laughs> what, killing Sonic? <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, Zack's still playing through Sonic 06, so I guess we'll get to that moment and eventually. Ooh, Maggie Dola. Finally, a good almighty skill. Let's go get that rare guy. But if you don't know, there's one thing that I love. Is there's a soundtrack I'm listening, right? Somebody mm -hmm. made a uh, all new, a unique Donkey Kong Country soundtrack called Double the Trouble. <laughs> it's really good. It's one of my favorite soundtracks. Yeah, I don't think I've heard that one. It's like a 74 song uh, album somebody made. Ooh. Quite a lot. Dang, no crits. There we go. It just Ooh. shocks me with how good the sound song is in Donkey Kong Country. How little people make original music with it. Yeah, that's definitely something I can say. I haven't heard in a lot of custom music with that sound font. <laughs> oh, everybody makes Super Mario World music. With a Super Mario World the font. Well, and the and the Mario 64 sound font too. I swear, I like every like every month or so, I hear like one new song, like one more recent like popular song in the Mario 64 sound font. It's like, hey, here's a uh, here's here's Persona 3 Reload music in the in the Mario 64 sound font. Dang, no crit. Better off just going for physicals here. Okay, I'm gonna try and do, uh, I'm gonna try and do New Super Mario Bros. again tonight. Around, like, I don't know, I guess it'd be like 10 p.m. for most people. Yeah. And, uh, if, if one person can't show up, then, you know what, sure, you, you could join. Since I, I know for a, for a fact you'll at least join, because, you know, I can't count on everybody else to join, guaranteed. Yeah. I'm gonna be hanging with my boyfriend tonight, but Sunday I'm available. Okay, well, if I don't do it tonight, then you can definitely do it Sunday. Because <laughs> I'm trying to make, I'm trying to make Sundays useful again, because I've just been not doing anything with them. Sunday is like my free day, and I like it. Yeah. So that would be that'd be perfect to try and play something. Dang. Poor Beetle, stop dodging. Well, and okay, now we definitely need to heal. Ooh, yeah, definitely, definitely heal now. <laughs> well, at least with my internet being out, I got to work on my ROM hack a lot last night. 
Wait, ROM hack. Were you making something? Yeah, I'm making a Paper Mario ROM hack. Oh. And it's, uh, it's pretty fun so far. So what does it change? Um, well, it changes, uh, like, the colors of all the areas. It makes the enemies harder. Um, kind of some balance changes. Just like, you know, your typical, like, first type of ROM hack for a game. <laughs> yeah. You know what's the thing, uh, like, I'll say? One of the things that I always like is Donkey Kong Country ROM hacks. Because even though, yes, it's just a color change, it really does make a level feel different sometimes. Yeah, exactly. And besides, here's the thing. Donkey Kong Country already in the vanilla game does that. Mm-hmm. So it's not like, oh, that's so unoriginal. It's like, no, Donkey Kong Country even does this. Oh yeah, you're right, because there's like a lot of like, there's like, there's like, I don't know, maybe two or three types of a stage, but like yeah. each one will be like a different color. Or like gimmick, yeah, and I always think that's really cool. I mean, I played, I played Donkey Kong Country last year. I know, um, Mario wanted to play Donkey Kong Country 2 with me. And 2 is really good. Yeah. 2 is really good. I've never played 2 all the way through anyways, so... That'll be, a uh, kind of- I'll be going in kind of blind. I've only played, like, the first two worlds. So, so here's the thing I'm asking. Are you planning to do the Lost World? Because if you don't want to do the bonus barrels, there's a quick, uh, little dev trick to get all 72 creme coins. Oh, you're talking about the thing where you jump over the bananas and, like, go into the little hut or whatever? Yeah. Yep, yep. Yeah, I still remember that. <laughs> I just when you know, I first remember the exact that, thing. I was, no, I, when I first discovered that, I was like, what in the fuck? <laughs> yeah, that's definitely a rare thing. Yeah, let's go back. The thing I've injured. always liked is warp barrels. I think warp barrels are really cool, especially when speedrunning. Mm-hmm. But no, one of my favorite things about Donkey Kong Country 2 speedrunning is how the entire game can be broken all because of a fucking beetle. <laughs> That's news to me. I don't think I've ever watched a speedrun of that game. So, okay, there is an enemy in the game called Click Clack, right? Mm -hmm. And what you do is you go up to an enemy while holding it, and then as it hits the enemy, quickly drop and pick up. And the game thinks you're still holding on to something, right? Mm -hmm. So it randomly ge generates a value based where you're on the map. And if you go into certain parts of the map and throw that invisible object you're holding, it can turn into a warp barrel and just end the level. That's wild. And I'm like, what the fuck? You are literally creating code because the game thinks you're holding onto an item and you're changing value based on your position on the map. What the <laughs> fuck? That's funny. You're literally executing code. So it begins. And to, that, to me, that is the funniest shit. All right, we got Mott, guys. We got the funny Nocturne coffin. You can't control this one yet. Um, what else can I make? Are you any good? Also, what do you think of my new profile picture? I don't think you saw it. It, it looks the it, it, I've seen that one for a while. Uh, oh, you seen that? Okay, yeah. then we did talk recently. <laughs> yeah, recent enough that I recognize it. Yeah. Which will you choose? Um. Well, these are new personas. I guess I'll just keep them. Very well. We look. Yeah, let me just save after that. Yeah, this DLC came out on, uh, I think it's, I think it came out on Monday, I want to say. I think it came out on Monday. 
I've just been playing it a shit ton. I'm like half done the DLC already. Yeah, hopefully everybody is free for uh, new Super Mario Bros. tonight. I mean, I'll ask them. <laughs> I still think Wonders, uh, Super Mario Bros. Wonder is amazing. Like the fact they have so many characters and everything. Well, I mean, I haven't I haven't finished that game. I only got to like the second world and then just kind of just kind of put on hiatus. So I mean. At some point, once we finish newer Super Mario Bros. Wii, we're gonna maybe do Wonder, because I need to finish that game. Uh, which of you has Auto Taro? Auto Rebellion? Oh, you have Auto Taro Kaja. There we go. Yo, it's the funny Tang! I'm itching for some action! I guess they're not weak to anything. No weakness? Ow. Jeez. Rude way to start off a boss fight. That's not a skill I want to see either. Um, do I have a Maypatra gem? Yes, I do. Good. Definitely don't want to get confused. Let's just try some physicals, see if anything works. Um, you know what? Scan them. See if they have any weaknesses. You're weak to lightning. And you're weak to ice. Oh, interesting. Well, I knew one of them was weak to lightning. Oh yeah, she has Boofu dying now. I didn't realize that. God, this album is so good. <laughs> I've listened to Rock Race Rumble Remix. Yeah, I already like DKC3's soundtrack, so... DKC3's soundtrack gets so much shit on it, but it's so good. Yeah, it is but good. I think, Evelyn, I think Evelyn Fisher really did good. Yeah, I agree. And from like, what I've just, heard, I don't like the, uh... I don't yeah. like the GBA version of the soundtrack. I fucking hate GBA version. It's too <laughs> cheery. Yeah, exactly. It's too upbeat and cheery. I think someone agrees Like, if somebody, me. if somebody was like, oh, hey, how would, what song would you prove that Evelyn Fisher is good? You know what song that would be? Nuts and Bolts. Oh, yeah, I, have, I, think I, you, ha I have that on my Spotify. <laughs> when you hear the guitar go, yeah, I love that. It's not like the most heavy metal song for Donkey Kong Country. Yeah, at least until Tropical Freeze. <laughs> yeah. Nuts and Bolts is really good. Mm -hmm. Yo, what if the Doom Slayer was in Donkey Kong Country? That would be his theme. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nah, it should just, it'll just be, um... It'll just be EM1M, but in the, the, the Dog Kong Country 3 sound font. Bro, I would fucking lose my shit. That'd be funny. Bro, you can respawn, dudes. Well, I don't think Yukari's really gonna hit Hex since he's on healing duty. Alright, let's, uh, let's charge up. Wrong her wrong move. Yep, do that. Hey, you know what? You know, Jupe, you can try and knock this guy down. Dang, no 
crit. Sad. Oh, I got an idea. Let's go for um. Actually, let's just do let's just do justice again. Cause I love this movie. <laughs> Oh shit. Hey Elijah. <laughs> Whoa, three we've reflected three times. That's crazy. Oh, and he's back to summoning. Okay, well if I just kill that guy over and over, he'll never get to attack. Then nice. Damage is kind of mediocre by this point in the game. <laughs> All right, do the good old, good old Orgia mode. Dang, no crit, really? That's the whole reason I did that move. Damn it. Fire won't work. Okay, then let's try swords. Yes! That's exactly what I wanted to see. Oh, and this guy- this- this guy's dead again. Fuck, he has evade electricity? Why am I just now finding out about this? There we go. And the tank is still alive, somehow. Pull the trigger. Um... Can I get a crit? Dang. Ooh, okay, tank tank is gone. Alright. Don't evade, please. Fuck. Ooh, this song. And a crit, dang. Not what I wanted to see. Wait, I, ha I have made Patra, what am I doing? Man, I wish I had Salvation already, that'd be nice. Maybe get a crit? Dang. I mean, that that's some pretty good damage, though. Alright, fist him. Boom. And he's still not dead. There we go. <laughs> and now I'm out of SP. Mission complete. Perfect. Alright, we got the chariot turret. I guess it's max HP plus 10. Oh. I mean, getting more HP for Aegis is pretty nice. Ooh, Auto Masuku. Hey. <laughs> How are you doing, Metis? Huh? Alright, let's, let let's go get those funny treasures. <laughs> Check out that we got Masters of Strength. We got aristocracy and dog toy okay I wish I could walk with my sister like this well thankfully we got a free heal now so thank God for that <laughs> good day Here are my requests. uh create a persona with auto masuku okay well I just did that so thanks Bring me the Shackles of Madness. That's probably for some mid-boss well. that I need to fight. Oh, help. Which I guess we'll get that done too, this episode. Hey. The 
Was well, Yukari gonna finally learn a good theurgy? That's... I forgot what her second theurgy was. I just remember it being good. I'm sorry. Well, if anything, I think Ken's is better, but I haven't, so I haven't been leveling up Ken at all. Uh, oh yeah, revives party, fully restores HP, and reflects one attack. Yeah, that's fucking good. <laughs> Thank you very much. It's a full heal plus a counter. I see. I think... He learns... Oh yeah, it's Mind Charge for the whole party. Yeah, that's pretty good, actually. I think someone else learns the exact move, but for the Charge variant. Hey. Oh hey, and Akihiko wants to hang out. All right. Masters of Strength. It's like Master of Tartarus. Or Masters of Shadow. Instead, it's Masters of Strength. <laughs> By the way, yeah, train harder. You gotta beat Mike Tyson eventually. Give me a break. <laughs> I can't say. Yeah, he said the answer. Lol. That's just something they're gonna keep repeating throughout this DLC. It's like, oh yeah, I know, I know the answer. He said the title, guys. Buff he said amp. the title. Oh yeah, that's one of his best uh, traits. Well, that's okay. I should put Akihiko back on because he. When he buffs himself, he's just frickin' OP. Alright, time to buy more sodas, because why not? Even though I'm a robot and I probably don't drink soda, but whatever, who cares? Hi. We gotta beat we gotta beat the fifth door. Dang, I have them already on the fifth door, that's crazy. Mario 3 up in here. There's like seven main worlds and then there's Koopa Land. I wish I could walk with my sister. Well, you're walking with your sister right now. Ooh, wait, this place is new. Um... <laughs> Finally, they're not recycling dungeon layouts. <laughs> we actually have something new. You know, I forgot to change out my party members. I guess I'll do that. I'll do that next uh, teleporter I get to. Strike attacks. Are you with the pierce too? No. Alright, well I'm gonna falcon punch you in the face then. Man, honestly, I see nothing wrong with this team. Especially since it has, uh, you know, like, we got a good healer, we got some great physical damage output. So there's absolutely nothing wrong with this loadout. And these dungeon designs are getting complicated. I guess that's a good thing, though. Four dancers. Do I have Miragi on still? Yep. Boom. I'm gonna be like level 80 and Junpei will still have Miragi. Which is hilarious that he's like the only character to get like a weak ass skill late game. 
Still don't know what anti-fire master is. I guess I'll get that. Oh, nice, nice level ups here. Yeah, I'm level 60 now. That's crazy. Uh, yeah, I don't need fast heal. I'm good. Hogown. I'll get rid of Marag. Actually, no. Get rid of Mahama. Mahama sucks. <laughs> I'll always give my all for my sister. Yeah, I'm level 60 now. Damn. We're so high level already. We're definitely gonna be like 80s by the end of the game then. Which I mean is good because I like I like it when I like it when games let you be like level 90 you know, for the final boss. It's not satisfying when there's like 99 levels, but you only ever get up to like level 40. I hate it when games do that. You know what's funny? What? Showing up to a level one boss is level 20 <laughs> after so much farming. Oh yeah, yeah that can happen too. <laughs> Well, if you're weak to Slash, then I'll just do Funny Death Bound. Yeah, yeah, perfect. Try and poison them too, why not? Boom. Oh, I, I don't know your weakness yet, actually. Punch the hand. Well, it's almost dead. Diaron. Okay, well, at least you healed yourself and not the hand. I can deal with that. <laughs> Scan this enemy, please. Tweak to ice. Okay. Kogown. Lol, you missed. I still have Bufu dying, so let's use that. You know, despite how much I want to keep Black Frost, I'm sure I'm not using him a lot. Max HP will increase. Yes, yeah, so let's go with that. <laughs> if I just get that card over and over, I'll be at like 600 HP in no time. Wrong game, bro. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I'm trying to look for the other one. Oh. Uh, I don't need Augie dying. I already have Augie like a crap ton. That went well. So now I have Null Slash. So now my funny Starfresh friend is like really OP. Take a dub doo doo. I mean, that's that sound that sound bite would have been relevant, like four years ago <laughs> but then again i think i don't think back i don't think discord had sound effects back then it's the funniest yeah, no. part yeah i'm like i'm like an og discord user i've been using that shit since like 2017 damn all right hey look <laughs> ken's gonna level up 13 levels um yeah we'll level up ken and the doggy I guess we'll put them on the team. Welcome back. It's like EA Sports. It's in the team. Except you don't have to pay $20. Yeah. Where's Ken? Where'd he go? Where the fuck is Ken? Oh, there he is. Um. <laughs> the party is full, though? Yeah, well, I'm only taking you so you can level up, and the dog can come because he's a dog. What's up, dog? Well, I mean, at the very least, I level up his weapons, right? Yeah, I did. Oh, yeah, before I'm here, let me give uh, Mitsu her new weapon. 30 SP! Great. Uh, elementary mask. Agility plus dark boost. That's pretty damn good. Cannon of treason, longbow of treason, sword of treason, fists of betrayal. Oh, yeah, I guess I'll even use a better weapon soon. Eh, I think we'll be fine. We can save. 
Hey, Elijah, are you gonna be free for new soup tonight? Yeah. Okay, good. Then if uh, if Aaron and Seb are on board, then we can we can do World Seven. Right. Which uh, yeah, guess what? It's been like a freaking year since we have played a new soup. Like normal new soup or not? Uh, newer, newer soup. Oh, I haven't. I don't think I've played new. I don't know why, but newer so soup. funny time talking about the soup game. Yeah, <laughs> we're gonna play soup. <laughs> yes. I'm at the soup store. <laughs> why are you buying clothes at the soup store? <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> I don't know why, but that um place it looks awfully familiar to the Judgment Hall from Undertale. You know what? Now I can't unsee it. <laughs> I can't unsee it now. About about the, about the about to go around the corner and then you just hear do 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 do. <laughs> right, punch the towers. Boom! Fought. Okay, did. that sounds wrong. What do you mean punch the towers? That's 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 correct. We use the justice. Oh, wait, today isn't the funny day anymore. Oh yeah, the funny day was a few days ago. Yeah. Really, no crits. All right, let's do Makoga. I mean, Ken's like ten levels below everybody, so hopefully he doesn't suck dick. That's crazy. Oh yeah, yes, bro, the you... best when a new party member added is at level one. Bro, you can't heal. Oh my god, he lost like 60% of his health. Ow. Fuka, what are these guys weak to? Fire? Okay. Burn them. Yeah, my partners are so weak, they're barely doing any damage. So I'm gonna- good lad, I'm leveling them up. Bruh. You really lived? Get out of here, bitch. Alright, but now Ken and Koromar are gonna get like a million levels. Ooh, the Diorama. And Makara Karn. Uh, get rid of Muhammad. Muhammad's shit. And get rid of uh, Arrow Rain. For Myriad Truths arrows. Petra Karn. Oh, frick. Um, get rid of Zianga. Ken's a light user through and through. And eh, you don't need Aga. Uh, Tempest Slash is better than Fatal End, I guess. No, don't need that. Oh, Aga. Are you doing anything after this? Um, I don't know. I'm not real. I'm not really. <laughs> Why? Formula Cartwheat. I could do Formula Cartwheat for a little bit. That was great, sister. I like how after that, Ken is still low level. <laughs> he's only level 47. Uh, he's gonna need a lot of doors. Alright. I guess I know it must be tough with your new responsibilities as leader. Let me know if you ever need help with anything. I'll do whatever I can. <laughs> Gold guy. Every time I say gold guy, I just get reminded of, um, that- I just get reminded of Family Guy Star Wars. Where, like, all, where, where all the Ewoks are just like, gold guy. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yeah, let's do good old virus breath. Which is a great new move that they added to this game. Cause that's not in, uh, that's not in FPS. What time is it? Get a crit? Well, maybe you won't be busy later. So it should only take like a half hour. So. All right. I mean, I'm gonna be playing this for a couple hours probably. Damn. Okay. I'm gonna try and beat this door. That's gonna be my goal. Yay! They're dead. Oh. Oh shit! He's got Maggie Dola. He's countering me with my own move. He's pulling his cock out. Okay, bro. <laughs> <laughs> what? Why is TwitchCon trending on Twitter? TwitchCon? Uh -oh. TwitchCon? Ooh. Ooh, Someone had sex at TwitchCon. What? Is that real? 
I don't know. Every time someone's trending on Twitter, it's automatically a bad thing. Yeah, that's why I don't use Twatter. Twatter. Yeah. Yeah, yeah Twatter. Twatter. Mm-hmm. Everyone knows the best social media site is Metopia. No, not Metopia, Mitomo. Metopia. <laughs> <laughs> Nah, bro. The best, so the best social link. Wait, social link. Social media is um, um, what? Book of Mario. No, I was gonna say Tomodachi Enterprise. Tomodachi <laughs> Enterprise. Yeah, there we go. Yes. With a dachi. With a dachi. That sounds like that sounds like um, you know, if Persona Four ever gets like another re-release, it's gonna be called like. Persona 4 Golden with Adachi <laughs> or something. Persona 4 Golden with new Adachi. New Adachi mode. No, no, it's gonna be, um, it's gonna be Persona, it's gonna be Persona X Adachi Generations. Okay, yo, what the f- <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah. Oh, that's peak. I definitely play that. Yeah, go to game. I mean, I, I would actually really love to play Sonic X Shadow Generations. Like maybe I am online. Yeah, I mean I don't know how well it'll run on my PC though. We'll see. <laughs> um, yeah. Ooh, because cards. Because I have I have Sonic Generations on Steam. Jose gave it to me like three years ago. I never played it. But maybe now I could just get Sonic X Shadow Generations instead. No one can stop me and my yeah. sister. And then uh, you know then I'll have the the better version, which which has Kingdom Valley in it. So it has Kingdom Valley. It's already go, dude. It's like one of the best Sonic levels of all time, right there. Where is Sans? Where is Sans? Where is... <laughs> I love this a dabble pin somebody bought. Officer, I drop kicked that child in self defense. <laughs> yeah, that, that, yeah, that, that was Mattis at the start of uh, the answer. She drop kicked the fuck out of Ken. <laughs> it's a tank! The tank is back, guys. Tank. Uni tank. Yes. Yeah, let's let's use Maraku Kaja again. And you're gonna be funny. Yeah, good. Evade the attack more, please. Oh, you know what? Let's do Mataru Kaja, because Metis is based. Hey, you guys want to know something that'll ruin the character of Metis for you? <laughs> what? Did you know Did you know her VA voices Pomni from the Digital Circus? <laughs> you swear to God. <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> I found that out, and now you have to know too. Damn, doggy, you OP. Scan the tank. Oh, he actually has a weakness. Hog. We play tanks better. <laughs> we we tanks. Fuck, oh, he dodged. What an ass hat. Okay, we need to kill this tank. You need to die, tank. Fuck, oh, don't punch it. This is the tank. Punching, who would have guessed that punching the tank doesn't work? <laughs> it worked every other time, though. Boom. That did fuck all. Um. Well, Pierce works, but I don't have a. I don't have anything like that. <laughs> I don't have Pierce on my doggy. All right, I guess take out the tank. You gotta take it out, please. Please, Mario. Please take out the tank. Okay. If this, if this doesn't kill, I'm gonna be sad. Kaboom. All right, good. We killed it. We killed the tank. Ooh. Spell cards. One of the best cards. <laughs> Spell cards. Spell cards. Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Uno cards. Yu -Gi -Oh all cards? the above. No. This meme, I, I hate how true it is when the fart wasn't actually a fart. Oh god, I seen that. <laughs> no. Oh no. Uh, 
layer to ice. Well, I have something cool. It's called Swift Strike. Boom. Do I have, like, Mabufu? Yeah, I do. I'm lazy. I'm just gonna use the cheap spells. This might be like one of the weirdest teams I've ever had. <laughs> we have a, we have two robots, a child, and a dog. <laughs> Hell yeah! Two robots, a child. And a dog. This is why this is why I love Persona Three. It has such a weird cast. But then again, Persona Two also has a weird cast. Well, not really. I think out of all the Persona cast, though, Persona 3 definitely has the most unique. Actually, no, Eternal Punishment is the best. Ooh, I'm Rita Shower. Yeah, because the thing about, uh, let, let, me, let me go over the, uh, the cast of Persona 2, if you guys don't know already. So, um, you have, like, you know, a reporter, she's in her 20s. And you know, that's already, a, that's already a great protagonist right there. Um, and then you recruit, like... Your your uh, your friend from uh, from like university. She's a boxer. <laughs> Damn. And then you meet like this old hacker guy <laughs> who lives in a basement. He's like thirty years old. And uh, prior to Persona Five Strikers, he was like the oldest Persona like character that you can play as. They don't really call me down. They call me down. Taking breaks, uh, is, still taking breaks is still. All right, who left their noise suppression off? <laughs> Wait. Um. Oh yeah, and then uh, you can also recruit two characters from the first Persona game, which is really cool, by the way. I think more. Uh, I think more Persona games should do that, honestly. Did you? Oh, hi, Seb. <laughs> hi, Seb. Yo, what's good? Yeah, sorry, my internet died last night. I don't know why I did that. Why did your internet die? Um. Uh, Shaw had a stroke, <laughs> and uh, for some reason they didn't want to fucking fix it until two in the morning. So why two in the morning specifically? I don't know. Oh, two in the morning, three, four in the morning for me. That's when I noticed it came back on. Well, more specifically, it came back on at like 1:45, but still fucking annoying. Three, three times in the morning for me. I was asleep at like 10:30, Jacob. I know. So I, I I also almost fucked up my sleep schedule by accident because of that. Get up. Your sleep schedule is messed up. Nah, my sleep schedule is better than like 90% of you here. <laughs> I go to bed at like 12 or 1 in the morning most of the time. I went to bed at 10.30 last night, Jacob. Huh, you know what? That's actually very reasonable. Is it edumacation? <laughs> edumacation? Jacob. What? You wanna hear a funny story? Sure. Dude, yesterday we had to go pick something up. We were told, oh yeah, don't go pick it up. We left, we had to turn back around to come get it. We are like, oh no, you gotta pick it up anyways. <laughs> you gotta pick it up. Oh, oh you're theory, <laughs> Angel <laughs> Phil. Ooh, fire amp. Um, ah, dang, that's so t I, I guess I'll get rid of growth too. There we go. Gross. What is this, Pokemon? Uh, well, basically, imagine, um, you know, the, you know the lucky egg, right? Yeah. Imagine that, but as a skill. <laughs> <laughs> a skill? You yeah. gain double XP? I'm not sure how, how you skill that, but you skill it. Yeah, it's, it's, a pretty, it's a pretty good skill, because you can pass it on to other personas, and then they can also get that. So, yeah, I like that. Ooh. Twilight Fragments. Um... Let me give my defense up. It's like the only Fuka ability I use. <laughs> Every other Fuka ability I just don't care about. Let's see here. Attack, worthless. Speed, worthless. Stash, worthless. Health, worthless. BP, worthless. Ooh, defense. Let me make him a tank. Well, because Fuka has, like, all of Fuka, other Fuka's other abilities are kind of useless. Like, oh, like, make all the enemies run away from you on this floor. You know, like, why would I want that? Jacob, I had the misfortune of playing Sonic 1 Mobile. 
Ew. Ew. I played it, and it's weird, because for one, they gave Sonic the spin dash, even though he doesn't have that in Sonic 1. I actually saw- hey, I said I got a better- I got a better version of Sonic 1 you should play. <laughs> It's called I, so I, it's called Sonic One Anniversary Edition for the 3DS. Jacob, no, you know what? Fuck you, Jacob. I have a better you know, version. Fuck you, all. You know what's better one? Sonic on the Game Boy Advance. I was gonna say that. Oh yeah. Uh, you How about idea. you suffer? <laughs> yeah, Jacob, you should play Sonic One on the game on the Game Boy Advance. Hey, hey, can I play that instead of Sonic Boom? <laughs> no. 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 <laughs> You're gonna play Boom and Rise of Lyric. Actually, I already- yeah, play... No, Boom is Rise of Lyric, dumbass. I thought they were two completely different things. No, no what the hell? Well, no, it's the game's just the called... subtitle. Yeah, oh. It's called Sonic Boom Rise of Lyric. Sonic Boom has other things, like, it has a TV show, it has two 3DS games, Fire and Ice and Shattered Crystal, we don't talk about them. Yeah, because those are- th the those... entire TV show and then play all the games. And that has a mobile game, it has a, a discount Sonic Dash, but Sonic Boom. <laughs> well, here's the thing. The thing is, the thing is, is Rise of Lyric Elite is at least funny. Fire and Ice and Shadow Crystal are just painfully like mediocre. Which I heard Boom was like bad because it's boring. Like there's nothing funny about it. It's just like, oh maybe because they patched it. Oh yeah, Jacob. When you play Boom, make sure it does not update. Make sure you play it on like the first version. You speak a monkey? Well, yeah, I'm not. I'm not patching it. Obviously, I'm gonna get the day one release. Yeah, if you, yeah, if you play a patch, then that's then that's a boring game. So, just like that's like, I mean, just like how it's, how it's a good thing Zach got um the normal version of 06 and not the patched version. I remember when Alfred made his video for for Boom, he put a joke. He's like, "All right, let's play the game." He sees that, he's like, "Oh, wait, none of the games I'm playing." He unplugs his Wii. <laughs> I mean, Wait, are you are you gonna do you have a Wii U capture card? Or are you just gonna like borrow it from Nintendo? No, no. The thing is, the the, the Wii U, the Wii U is built. The Wii U has an HDMI output, so I can plug my capture card into that. Oh, so you're gonna play this on authentic hardware? I'm gonna play- I'm playing it on real hardware, for once. <laughs> oh, well, bad news, Jacob. I heard that on real hardware, the game has a tendency to drop frames. It'll probably drop frames on MU anyway, so who cares? <laughs> yeah, but it's worse if it drops frames, because that, that just says that, nope, this isn't my emulator screen, this is just how the game runs. That'll make it better, actually. <laughs> What, the frames dropping? Yeah, because at least we'll know, like, yeah, this game does- this game sure does suck, guys. Yeah, and also... Okay, I'm waiting if for you guys iconic... had to do a stream, but it had to be a bad game, what would it be for laughs? For laughs? Like, a funny bad game? I'd do... What would Vanilla I do? Mario Kart Wii. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, like, if I were to stream it, I would have to be, uh, Legend of Zelda CDI. Oh, I already streamed that I a few years ago. <laughs> oh shit, really? Yeah. And how did that go? Um, well, see, the thing is, I didn't play the- I didn't play the original release. I played, um, the HD, like, widescreen fixes version that actually makes it decent. Yeah. I love- <laughs> That is illegal, you know, guy. <laughs> oh yeah, that guy is Pog. I love how Warshoe Lonely has two lines and everybody's like, he is the GOAT. Exactly. Game. Guys, I have a question. What's what's the absolute worst game you've hundred percented? Like what's um, the, like the one game you you hundred percent and then you regret doing it? Jacob, don't say boom because I ain't gonna do that later. But like you know. <laughs> um. What is the hey, worst? Are you gonna hey, are you not one hundred percent boom? Or are you just gonna play it, beat the story, and be like, all right, I'm done? Wait, you can one hundred percent boom? <laughs> what the fuck? Yes. Wait, really? Yeah, there's there's in any game, bro. Yeah, if it's any like, game I played that was absolute dog water, wait, Superman wait, 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 64. Wait, 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 give it a second, Jacob. Yeah, no, there's side quests you can do. Ew, why would I want to do that? <laughs> I mean, Zach did all the side quests, so, uh... No, no he didn't. Yes, he did. In what? Wait, did he? In what, 06 or boom? <laughs> No, six. He did, all, did Zach do all the side quests in that six? No, he didn't do all the side quests. He did like a couple, and then he because he just wanted money. But then he hacked, he hacked all the money in, and then he stopped like caring. <laughs> mm. Like he, like. Oh, Seb, have you, Seb, have you seen Silver's ring count? Oh. He's in Wait, debt, bro. Do I have to one hundred percent? Do I have to get all ten endings for Shadow? 
I mean, I thought that was a general consensus. <laughs> Oh god, we're never gonna beat that game, Jacob. You realize how long it's gonna take if I have to get all 10 endings for Shadow? Hey, that, oh, him playing Shadow the Hedgehog would actually be funny. I, I'll give you props on that one. Bro, the amount know, of pain it, of doing that Vector the Crocodile mission, I can already hear him screaming into his mic. Oh, <laughs> I never played Shadow the Hedgehog. I played like the first level for LOL, and I did the hero mission. Jacob, I'm just gonna tell you this, that my first playthrough of the game is gonna be the neutral mission. Oh, well, obviously, everybody does the neutral route first. Yeah, because it's the easiest one. It's just, oh yeah, go to the end of the level, that's it. I mean, when I saw, when I saw Vine Sauce Joel play, he just did, like, the neutral route, and then he never played it again. Yeah, probably because the game was that bad, then why would you ever want to continue? Yeah, and also, uh, just for the record, don't play the PS2 version. I heard that one's worse. <laughs> oh no, I'm playing the GameCube version. Oh yeah, you know what? You know what mission you're gonna have fun with, Seb? What? You're gonna have fun with that one that one mission where you have to save all of like the gun members and one of them despawns for no reason. <laughs> I heard one of them was bad where there's a long level, you have to kill like 45 gun gun and you have to restart if you fail. Oh yeah, that shit like that's all over Shadow the Hedgehog. Yeah, no. I oh, you know, I don't wanna do the Maria levels. Oh boy. Yeah, so that's just because she can like despawn or something and mess shit up. No, you can- I saw a glitch where if you like spin dash and jump at her, you can like- cause For some reason, both of Maria's levels don't have the roof loaded in. So you can Weird. just jump over the roof and go to the next area. And... I don't know, I feel like, honestly, Zack got the best of the three Sonic games. <laughs> and you got the worst? I don't know, depending on, depending on the mood, you might have gotten the worst, honestly. Because Shadow is... I, the best I mean, I don't know. It, it depends. Well, how long is Shadow... Like, how long does one ending take to get in Shadow? Um... On average? Probably, like... If, 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 you're, if you don't die and fuck up, probably, like, an hour or two. So, but if that logic follows, we could do, like, 11 episodes. Because there's 10 endings if you don't include the final one. So just one episode per ending, and then you do the final ending, and that's its own episode, and then boom, we, have, we beat Boom in 11 episodes. Yeah, but that... You mean you mean Shadow, not Boom. <laughs> but that's but that's that's being optimistic, though. <laughs> because uh, Shadow has a lot of jank. So I don't know. Yeah, I, I told you, I played the first level. He is clunky to control, and the gun... He slippery like, as the, the guns are like the... Yeah, and also... I thought, here's the thing, I thought the spin dash was useless in Adventure 2. Oh my god, the spin dash is useless in, in wait, Shadow. Wait, wait, the spin dash is useless in Adventure 2? I thought it was. I played City Escape. I didn't need to use the spin dash. Well, I just kinda... do, you watch, do you watch Jay's reviews, Seth? Jay's review? Maybe, yeah. Maybe, maybe. Go look Hold up it. Go watch his newest video. It's about Sonic Adventure 2. <laughs> Jay reviews. Yeah. Oh yeah, I saw that video that I recommended. Yeah, it's good. I watched it last night when my internet was out. Oh, I've watched one video. I watched his What Made Sonic 4 episode 1 so awful. Yeah, he does shit like that all the time. It's great. Pretty much, I played Sonic 4 episode 1. Yeah, and we already know that's the worst game you've played this year. I know, it is. It's hilariously bad. Like, but here's my thing. I'm trying to get the 7 Chaos of I am a- Alright, I'm gonna give you all some advice. Do not grab a Chaos Emerald in the first- If you ever played War, which don't, do not grab the Chaos Emerald in the first one. Save that one for last. So that way when you get- when you- Because the seventh- Because the seventh special stage is hard. And you're gonna have to retry it a couple times. So if you need to, you can just go into the- Into level one, replay it a million times. I made that mistake. So I have to play Lost Labyrinth every time I want to retry that special stage. Wait, that's how that works? That's stupid. Well, here's the thing, you can retry the special stage in the special stage, but it's kind of hard to do because you have to, like, realize, oh, I'm going to screw up and do it yeah. before you run into the goal zone. Okay, so... if you get the goal zone, so, you can't pause. I owned Sonic 4 Episode 1 on the PS3 when it came out. Uh, it was... It, it, I mean, I was, a, I was a dumb kid. I didn't know any better. I didn't know what a shitty game was. So yeah, I was just like... I was, just, I, was like yeah. I was like, dude, I love Sonic 3. I want to play this, this is the fourth game. <laughs> And then I realize, and, and then now I'm realizing later, it's like, oh, that wasn't supposed to be Sonic 4. <laughs> yeah. that, because if, for all of you who 
probably know already, Sonic 4 Episode 1 was originally known as Sonic Mobile, and they rebranded it as Sonic 4 Episode 1 for, uh, you know, to get money, basically. Yeah, for the PS3, uh, Xbox, and the PC. And the Wii. I think it used to be free, if I remember correctly, it used to be free, and then they threw it on Steam for money. It was free on mobile, and it's it costed money everywhere else. Actually, here's my story. So, before I knew what bad games were, I played Forces. You. And I, yeah, I played Forces, and I actually didn't think it was a bad game. Like, I played it, I beat it, I was like, oh, actually, that game was pretty cool. So then, like, two years go by, and I see... The video saying, dude, Boom was a, I mean, not Boom, dude, Forces was a bad game. And I'm like, <laughs> really? I don't remember it being a bad game. Here, let me replay the game and just see what I think. So I delete my save file. I replay the whole game. I, I beat it in one hour. I beat it in the game in like three hours. Damn. And after the next year, I was like, oh my god, that was a horrible game. Why the hell did I ever play that? <laughs> I think the level that made me realize it was a bad game, it, it was one of the Avatar levels, which is kind of funny because most people think the worst levels are classic Sonic's level, which I don't get me wrong. There's the one that I'll talk about later. But yeah. it was one of the Avatar's levels that made me realize, okay, this game kind of sucks. It was the one with the, you remember the, you know that weird giant crab thing? Nope. <laughs> Ooh, there's a lot of tough guys on this floor. Okay, well, there's a level where you have to destroy a crab thing for a distraction, and that level is so annoying. Oh boy. Looks like that one will be tough to beat. And then the the icing on the on the cake was there's a level with Classic Sonic where they make probably the biggest mistake you can make for a for a Sonic game. Oh, I see why. Uh, I see why four skin is mid now. No, no, I haven't even told you what the mistake was. Oh god. They made an auto scroller. There's an auto scroller in a Sonic game? Yes. Well, Seb, I could tell you about an auto scroller in a Sonic game. It's called Bridge Zone. Are you telling me about. Huh? Are you talking about the Game Gear version? Yeah. yeah Game Gear. You, ever, oh, yeah. you ever heard of Bridge Zone, Seb? <laughs> yes, I've heard of it. I watched Troy Five's video on all the Game Gear games. Yeah, that's an, there's an auto scroller in that level. It's pretty bad. I know. Yeah, he went, wow, an auto scroller in a Sonic game. I hope no one ever tries this again, and it slowly pulls up the forces level. <laughs> That's funny. You heard of Sonic Forces, but have you heard of Sonic Forces you to commit tax fraud? Dang. Sonic Forces you to math. I thought, I thought, and I thought Yoshi was bad. Are you talking about Sonic SMG4? Forces you to SMG4? <laughs> what about SMG4? The fact that Yoshi doesn't pay his taxes in SMG4? Well, it's not, that's not Sonic just an SMG4 you to joke. Play a better game. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Sonic forces you to Sonic, play better games. Sonic forces you to eat chili dogs. Well, here's the thing, I still haven't learned my lessons because I'm 100 percent in forces. Yeah, you that, know, there's your first I, mistake. As much as you joke that about that, bias, I already feel like the internet would have a fat fetishist idea of forcing Sonic, I mean, making Sonic force you to eat chili dogs. I hate the internet. <laughs> I hate it so much. Dang it, internet. Dang it, internet. You ruined it. We had something good and you ruined it. You ruined- you ruined chili dogs, how could you? You know... Honestly, I think- What's another bad game I've played? Is there a bad game- Okay, it's like, if I say- If I include mobile games, then that's kind of cheating. Yeah, because all mobile okay. games are bad. This game isn't, uh, bad, but... One game I feel like everybody kind of misses and goes, What the fuck is that? Uh, the Speedy Gonzalez game on Super Nintendo is actually quite a bit of a I banger. never played that. I have no idea what the uh, hell you're talking about. I am just remembering no. that exists. Uh, Los Gatos Banditos. It's the Sonic one. That's really good on Super Nintendo. Oh yeah, I think I remember that now. Oh, I missed. I haven't played many Super Nintendo games. I think the only Super Nintendo game I played was Mario RPG. Yo, and, you uh, played Peak? Out. Yes, I did play Pete, because, okay, so my cousin, he had, you know those little NES, those little SNES thingies that you could buy? You're talking about the SNES Mini? I don't know, but I, maybe, but basically it's a SNES, and you plug it in, and it has just a bunch of SNES games on it. And yeah, 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 the SNES Mini. Those are oh, really rare, by the way, so you're, 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 your relative's fucking lucky. <laughs> as soon as you said Mario RPG, I just my, dad's friends has, my, my uncle has it too. 
No, I'm telling you, bro, the, the fucking SNES Classic, SNES Mini, whatever the fuck it's called, it's that's a rare-ass thing. So, I don't know how the fuck you have two of those, they're pretty rare. Uh, have you seen the modded one that they sell on eBay that actually have all the games? I yeah. mean, that's pretty cool. <laughs> I also have I also have a I also have a SNES Mini. It's called my computer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, yo, that's crazy. I have one too. Yeah. Did you buy yours? As you are speaking right now, minus pros, the Nintendo ninjas are heading your way. Mm. Aw, damn. Well, I mean, I've been I've been uh, I sure haven't seen those Nintendo ninjas, even though I've been doing some funny stuff for the past twelve years, or however long I've been doing this stuff before. But no, I hear like how bad Nintendo is with fan games and stuff like that. It's bad. Yeah, Sega. Cause even like, if, if there's one department Sega has a Nintendo beat, it's their handling of fan games. Cause Sega's logic is, listen, you can make a fan game, just don't sell it. Like, make it free. Don't make any money off it. That's bad. Yeah, or like, either that, or be uh, be Christian Whitehead and just get hired by Sega. What mod did you I, make? I, I, I wonder if like Sega is still butthurt about that. They hire a fan game developer, makes one of the best Sonic games in the fucking years, then proceeds not to want to hire him again. <laughs> because that, and you know what makes it really fucking funny? What? Like super fucking funny? That same year uh, Sonic Forces released. Oh yeah, well, oh, we, we, we've had that combo hey, do you know before. The do you know the, the story of Forces? <laughs> what? Wait. So basically, if you look at the credits, there's only three level designers. Three. Yeah, that's almost as, that's the the, worst that's almost as many people that worked on Sonic Mania. <laughs> yeah, and then what makes it worse is that of the three, one of them has experience in Lost World, and the other two have never touched a Sonic game. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But the creators that brought you Sonic Generations, we have yeah, none, hired, of, none, none, of the, none of the level designers. <laughs> <laughs> that that's like yeah, that's that's like um I don't know that's like if you hired the the level designer of Hotel Mario to work on the next Mario game, and then you just gave him two newbies who have never made a Sonic game ever. Let's open it up. I mean a Mario game. Actually, you, you 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 take a Mario game and you take all the level designers and you make them Sonic level designers and you make them make a Mario game. Sorry. I mean, but there are times where it does work. For example, uh, Shinji Mikami. The guy that literally pioneered survival horror as we know it today. You want to know what his game he was working on with Capcom? What? He was working on fucking Goof Troop on the Super Nintendo. Isn't that game good? Okay, here's I've... the... Alright, here's... Wait, here's... I have something. So here's... I don't think it's a bad game. I think it's a good game, but everyone else thinks it's a bad game. Pokemon Sword and Shield. Dude, I love those games. I think they're so good, and I hate that people just assume they're bad games. I played it, I beat it in two days, and I thought it was just forgettable. <laughs> I feel a bit un oh, I mean, like, it's weird because I had such, like, admiration for Sun and Moon. And then I was like, oh yeah, I can't wait to see what Sword and Shield does. And I just like, man, this this, this story's kind of mid. <laughs> Almighty hand. What is your guys' thoughts on Scarlet and Violet? It's got good Great waifus, game, that's about it. Wait, what I like the game. It's got good waifus, and that's about it. <laughs> yep, the, everyone's like, I like the, uh, the first trainer you meet. You know, people are uh, portrayed as a tomboy or an absolute yandere psychopath that just stalks you everywhere. Well, I mean, see, Seb agrees. Like, Seb agrees, he likes like... Nomona. <laughs> yeah, that was great. Hey, it's Dominic. Hey, Dominic. Uh, do it's hear... Dominic. That's not Dominic, that's Dorian. How do you, st how do you still keep fucking that up, Seb? <laughs> That's cool. Wait, I've made that mistake oh, before. Sure. How, do you, how do you keep accidentally calling Dorian Dominic? Who's Dominic? The worst I, don't, I think what makes it worse is that I don't do it the other way around. I don't call Dominic Dorian. That's funny. It's always just I call Dorian Dominic. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how you do that. They both start with I mean, DL. I mean, they, yeah, yeah, I mean, they're, they're kind of similar names. Not really. I mean, we got Dorian, we got Dominic, we got Dustin. <laughs> we got Desmond. We have Desmond. Desmond. Um, is Desmond even still hanging with you? I mean, we play. We play Terraria. That's about it. You know, honestly, something else I just remembered is do you remember is that about Sonic Forces is that the Chaos Emeralds are DLC. Nice. Ew. Nice. We did. 
Wasn't it free that? Wasn't it free though? They yeah, made, they made it free. downloadable they, content. Like, I think they made it free. Like, part of the main game. Oh yeah, didn't they like charge you money for it? They were, but then they got like a lot of backlash, so they decided to make it free. Yeah, and then it came with episode shadow, which they did by the way, basically what they did was they made the DLC the chaos emeralds, and then you can play a shadow in Sonic's levels. Bro, why is everybody That's reflect Pierce? Like, Sonic and Pierce. Shadow Generations looks really good, but you gotta admit, that name of that game, that... <laughs> that <laughs> implies really things. Didn't... Well, that implies it's things? a, um, it's a regional thing. Because, in Japan, the word X means and. So, the actual name is Sonic and Shadow Generations. Yeah, except we think it means Sonic X Shadow. Sonic Sonic X Shadow, which is a different thing. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Is that a game about gay sex? <laughs> Say Gex <No>. Sonic? <laughs> what? How could this be? Oh shit. I, I feel betrayed. I feel so bamboozled. How could you do this to me? <laughs> it's the Bean Boozle challenge. <laughs> oh, they're waiting to punch? That's good to know. Oh shit, I'm in the orange hall. Oh shit, here comes Pac Man. You're not being. Oh wait, no, I can't say that. You're not being too kingly, Phil. Because I didn't really guess. Uh. Oh hell yeah, I can get sexy dance. <laughs> sexy dance! I don't have that move yet. <laughs> what? You would. No, you would be that kind of person that'd be like, ah, oh, yes, I'm gonna go into D and D and do interpretive dancing for fucking everything as a solution and annoy all my <laughs> quest givers. There's a tracker shed. Dude, episode shadow is so stupid. It's three levels and it tells you nothing. It's supposed to be a pre a prologue, but it tells you nothing. It tells you nothing about anything. Yep. So, and it's just like stupidly hard for no reason. The only thing, uh, the only thing I know is that we got some pretty sick remixes of, uh, old Shadow songs, like White Jungle. White Jungle? Yeah, White Jungle. Pretty, pretty banger song. Um, you know, let's try Mabufula. Dizzy and can't get up. Great. Great. Oh shit, they heal from that. Alright, what are you guys weak to? Um try Deathbound maybe? I can tell you what Jacob's weak to. Uh what? Women. <laughs> I what the fuck? I just how did you read my mind? I was gonna make the same joke. Really? What did you get for stealing my bit earlier? <laughs> Auto Rahukaja or Experience. Hey, that cannot feel good. Well, being weak to women. Let me, let me fucking a robot. Oh. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> listen, I'd, I'd listen. If there's a will, there's a way. Clank, Wait. clank, 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 clank. Wait, Dustin wants to fuck a robot? Hey, yo. Wait, is it Omega? <laughs> is it you? E one zero two three Omega. Well, yeah, it depends. It will depend. Yeah, it depends on the robot. Are we talking about like I guess, or are we talking about like you know an actual robot like you know Omega? Because you know, it really changes the subject there. Because I mean, I guess it's just you know your friendly neighborhood toaster. Toaster. I hate toasters. Well said, I don't you know, know why, you know what but they the say. idea of like <laughs> listening in the other room and you just hear clank, 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 clank. Instead of plap, 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 plap. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, I just think we were fucking fixing a machine or something, not having sex with a robot. Let's think. Yeah, I mean, technically, 2B is an android, so. Well, yeah, Android. 2B, 2B is the kind of robot people want to fuck, so. Yeah. Wow, that's it. That's all of episode shadow. It takes you straight to that Tetsu and Forces where Sonic loses. <laughs> great, really good role building there. Sonic yeah, we're him. great. He told me Infinite is a guy who hates Shadow, and now he's here to kill Sonic. I mean, I mean it doesn't help that uh, 
Infinite is just a painfully mid character. Yeah, he has nothing special to him. Also, he's like the littlest, biggest bitch, and he throws like a little baby fit over to get his ass kicked by Shadow. Yeah, hold on, I'll I'll be right back. And then he takes his, and then he and then he proceeds to take his anger out on Sonic. The only like villain I can respect is Mephilus. <laughs> Mephilus is actually pretty fucking badass. Is it just is it just because he kills Sonic? He killed Sonic, he constantly mentally fucked with Shadow. I think Neo Metal Sonic is cool. Look, what a cool robot. It's a song. Alright, Horamar, I'm gonna switch you out for hey, a yo, Ego. Chicken 4 soundtrack? Yeah. I do like me some Tekken music. But have you ever heard Tekken 4 OST? <laughs> nope, I've mostly heard Tekken 7 and Tekken 8. <laughs> Tekken 4 music is really good. I mean, okay, I've heard a bit of the first three as well. I mean, I've heard Jin Kazama's theme. That song's a banger. Okay, another door. We're gonna I, love, I love the wet moment where they do the, like, the new Super Mario Bros. with the bap bap bass and the Sandy Beach theme. <laughs> bop, bop. And honestly, that's one thing I kind of like about newer Super Mario Bros. movies. It doesn't have that. It has its own identity. Alright. Are they weak to light? I haven't been using light skills much, so we'll see. Alright. Um... Funny lions. No. Not weak to ice. Are you weak to punch? Boom. Fuck. Are you awake to lightning? No. No weaknesses? Damn. Oh, got Falcon punched. You it... may have no weaknesses, but you have zero bitches. Okay, you just punch a child. Alright, scan the enemy. I don't know their weakness. Awake to wind? Well, shit, I didn't have wind. I wasn't using it. Oh, you're using the food knee move, Rebellion. Alright, that's just for one person. Oh, right. I just got knocked down. Oops. Um, well, I don't know what else to do. I can't use my punch skills, sadly. The game's actually making me think. Hey, you're gonna increase your crit rate, why not? Um, yeah, sure, heal. I don't really have anything else to do. Dude. All right, one lion's dead. And we get experience and uh, I guess single target boost. I don't have that skill card yet. Revive with, uh, I guess we'll get rid of Koga then. Yeah, Sabe Recarm is pretty nice. Huh. That was a good workout. How are you? 
Alright, increase my defense again. I'll admit this tag's gonna be way easier since I have our ego now. Never mind, it's not a tank, it's a Minotaur. What? Okay, what's the what what are you weak to then? Um You know what, Maraka Kunda, why not? Yeah, heat wave, bitch. Wow, that barely hit. Well, you know what? Let's use divine intervention because I can. Getting a reflection is pretty nice. Um, you know, what? let's do good old Mataru Kaja. How long are you gonna take the set up? Dog and pawn. That didn't really do that much, actually. Alright, um. Let's see if I can freeze it. Boom. Dang, it didn't freeze. Haha, uh -huh. blocked. Okay, we know he blocks punch now. Myriad arrows, maybe? He resists that. Uh, are you weak to wind? No. Okay, what about... I know, let's lower your attack too, why not? <laughs> do the classic SMT thing. Have I tried it dark yet? That, I mean, that is weak to dark. Nah. Heat wave, boom. I mean, as long as he doesn't crit, I don't really care. Do we need to light, maybe? Oh, he reflects light. What the fuck? Yes, please scan it. It has no weaknesses. So, in other words, um, just spam spells. Um. Hmm. Yeah, it's called Zianga, I guess. Meow. This guy's gonna be annoying to take down then, because I can't do anything against him. I don't really have a good way to knock him down. I'm just gonna steal your SP then, don't mind me. <laughs> the fence reverted. Boom. So, uh, Ken can't really do much here. Besides Pierce, I guess. Um, even Tetra card doesn't really do much. Yeah, I just do Myriad Arrows, I guess. That'll do something. Who's that yelling in the background like that? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> I think uh, Dorian forgot to mute again or something. <laughs> oh, this guy's gonna take so damn long to kill, bro. I'm gonna keep stealing your SP, don't mind me. Cool. Alright, now we can heal. I do have that Malice Magatama that I can use still. Ooh. That does a decent amount of damage. Yep, just keep doing that. Cool. Yeah, I'm gonna keep draining your SP because I'm Funi like that. 
attack averted. Oh boy. Damn, that did a lot. Alright, let's see if I can... <laughs> I can do 91 damage. Yeah, we're not getting anywhere with this. I think I pretty much stole his SP now. <laughs> yep. Yeah, Heat Wave. Yeah, let's go for, uh... Divine Intervention again, why not? Get a nice physical wall. Boom. It's like the longest battle ever. <laughs> 38 damage, that did jack shit. What? You dodged that shit? <laughs> nope. Maybe I can get a crit. Nope. No crits? We'll kill, we'll kill this Minotaur eventually. I'm not fighting this fucking guy again. This guy's annoying to fight. Can I get actually get Megadol to land, please? There we go. Plus he has like regenerate on, which is really annoying. This guy is ironically harder than a boss fight. Well, he's not harder, he's just taking a long time. At this point, Maggie Dolo is gonna be the thing that kills him. There we go, jeez. Uh, hey, look, Rondo's back. Just think of what? Evade Pierce. And that's that's a pretty nice thing to have. Ooh, finally, we have Gigant. Well, I can't wait till we get God's Hand. That's gonna be really good. Insta Heal. Recover from ailments in one turn. Um. Nah. I'm not worried about statuses. It looks like we can There's the exit. There's a shadow. Okay, I guess we're done here. Man, these floors are long. Oh, there's Dorkun. Okay, let's go back and heal. Guess we have to be getting close to the end of this door then. Actually, no, we're not that close. We just have another boss, that's it. How are you? Oh, Fuka's out of SP. We need to give the beans some more SP. Hold up. There we go, we got, we got chewing souls, we'll be fine. Yes. And... Yeah, start with Auto Rebellion. Well, hang on. Which one's better? Re I think, I think, isn't Revolution better? Which one of you has Rebe Revolution? Yeah, Rebellion and Revolution are two different moves, it's kind of confusing. I mean, it's still up crit rate, so that's good. A bird and eyeballs. Okay. The Archer, the Acheron Seeker, and Ice Raven. 
I mean, I could probably guess what the Ice Seeker is weak to. <laughs> Boom. Wait, it's also weak to fire? Oh, wait, that's weird. You know what's really funny? When RPGs throw uh, you and Aluba say, yeah, actually, Ice is weak to lightning or thunder. And you're like, what? Well, that seems to be the case. This guy is the one that weak to fire, not the bird. You know, the ice raven. That makes a lot of sense. Maybe got a crit. What? You reflect? Bullshit. Oh, and you are, you're funny. You have spirit drain? I don't like that. Why does your spirit drain drain 100? Mine only heals like 20. That's fucking bullshit. Um, alright, let's charge up. And then, uh, we'll use a Fear Sutra. And... Um, <laughs> after Fine Sutra... Now we got the fence down. Oh yeah, let's use uh, let's use divine intervention again. You know, we got to be like Palutena. Just get a free, just create a free like wall. Oh, now you're gonna use Maggie Dola. Wow, thanks. <laughs> Completely ignore my wall. Alright, let's let's kill these guys in like one turn. We're gonna do like max damage. It's probably gonna be the highest damage I've done in this game so far. Let's see. Fourteen hundred damage. <laughs> Holy shit! He's fucking dead. Oh my god. Oh yeah, guess what? The fucking Ice Raven's weak to swords. <laughs> that makes sense. I mean, thankfully I have Deathbound. Oh great, you have Evade Slash. That's fun. No. Alright. Uh, unfortunately, Ken doesn't have any... Uh... Slashing skills, though. So I guess we can just heal. For healing, anyways. Come on, man. You couldn't have used, like, the. Oh. <laughs> Never mind. It's dead. That did 750 damage, and that was, like, uncharged. I guess it's max SP plus 7. Oh, okay. So it's the other one, but it says for SP instead of HP. Oh, hell yeah! We got Brave Blade? Oh shit, I don't know what to get rid of. I guess I'll get rid of Virus Breath. I probably don't need that. Uh, don't need, uh... Oh, we don't need... I don't need two status curing things. Uh -huh. New skill, huh? Nice. I'm flattered. Yes. Oh. All right, let's see. If we get some more funny rare, like rare treasures. Shot. At least I'm not running out of Twilight fragments like in the journey. Re custom parts. Non-fiction novel. Hero's cape. Is that just for Ken? I mean, probably. Oh, apparently I got a Sami of Tengu. I don't, I don't remember when I got that. Um. Well, I guess I can give Akihiko the Kaiser armor now. And we got Spice set. 
figure keeps just sending shadows after us. And then... I do like spices, they're very good. Get some more quests. More Twilight Fragments, that's nice. Are you accepting a request? Bring me an Emperor's Horn. Okay, well, we'll get that die at some point as well. Very well. Let's go fuse some personas. We haven't done that in a while. How splendid. Wow. Weakness amp. Ooh. Now I guess it's even more OP. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Alright, let's see. What can we get now that we're higher level? Let's register Let's these as well. Alright, um... Fusion. Actually, can I... Can I... Oh, I can... I'm getting pretty close to summoning Alice. That's pretty nice. I can get... Oh, I can get Gabrielle. Nice. Please choose what skills to inherit. I think I need to summon Gabriel at some point anyways. Um, you know what? Carry over, uh, Auto Rebellion. Actually, no. Yeah, Auto Rebellion and... Actually, no. Revolution and Crit Rate Amp. <laughs> yes. So it begins. I never used mod a single time, apparently. <laughs> Just because physical skills are way more fun to use. Plus I need I plus I need Gabriel for a fusion anyways. Uh Cert. Cert's good. Let's carry over Garudine. Um Growth 3. Sama Recarm. And I guess uh Evade Pierce maybe. Well then. Be a good fire user now. Plus, Cert's always a like, badass persona to get anyways. Uh, Auto Taru Kaja. Is that, is that gonna turn into Auto Mataru? <laughs> oh, hell yeah! Well, that's, oh, that's broken. Uh, Byako. Um... Hmm, let's see. I can't, I can't use that yet. I can get Daisojo. Oh yeah, it's the funny, uh, it's the funny Nocturne guy. Um... Please choose the personas you would like to fuse. I the only new one here. Hmm. This what do you wish to inherit? Can I carry over Mataru Kaja? Hell yeah, let's go with that. Um... Resist Light, that might not be a bad one to carry over. Amrita um, Shower. Medea Rama. <laughs> a new power emerges. I'm just gonna like, sack off some personas, see what I can get out of it. Oh, I'm really close to being able to get Thor. Oh, I can get uh, I can get Pazuzu. This persona. What do you wish Hell yeah! To All right, carry over Mataru Kaja, obviously. Um, Invigorate, Herculean Strike, and, um, Spirit Drain, maybe? So it begins. Yep, Zuzu's pretty good. Plus, that's actually a new Persona. Alright, um... Dang, I'm so close to the only get Thor. Well, no personas. Have you all the elements you need? Hmm. Well, looks like you do need Pazuzu for Mara. I honestly don't know if I'm gonna be able to get all these personas. I'll try though, because they're pretty good. Accept yourself. Accept. Your ability? What kind of persona? Registering, I see. 
Sure, we'll it's register over. you. All registered. Hooray! We did it. <laughs> Let me see. Uh... <laughs> Zach says, what? <laughs> Aaron says, I don't wear hats. Seb says, why not? It's accurate either way. Aaron says, I got glasses, too. <laughs> That's funny. Hey, what's the piece of the Oh, we look the block the block like, yeah, dead. Yeah. <laughs> what are y'all talking about now? <laughs> what <Wow>, bitch? <laughs> <laughs> hey Nikki, what happened earlier? Alright. Let me uh let me say I had this fill with water, right? I had it freeze overnight so that uh, whenever it melts in it's like the water would be like extra cold. And then I dropped that cup. And then, what's the cut? The ice broke through the bottom of the cup and just fell out. That was so good. What is bro on about now? Tragic. Uh, I was a styrofoam. We have a bunch of these big ass styrofoam Okay, let me, let me save and heal real quick. Oh, hey, you can do some drugs in the next battle. No save, no healing, just get wrecked. <laughs> oh, trust me, that's happening. You know, like, I mean, most of the time when I get a game over, I only lose like I only, I only lose like two or three floors of progress. <laughs> Ambush has been enhanced again. Cool. You are now able to crumble breakable objects. Well, I mean, I like apple crumbles. Does that count? No, it's not apple crumble. Sadly. Um. Oh hey, look, du we're gonna let's talk to the man. Luca, get out of the way. I gotta talk to the man. Yo. Nothing at all. Thanks, man. Yeah, let's hang out with the man. We found the spice set. <laughs> the spice set. Yo, I could use a spice set right now. Cause I ran out of roasted garlic. How am I supposed to cook without roasted garlic? Only because you lack skill. Damn. <laughs> Damn. Just roasted dumb man. Um, <laughs> this table cannot be turned. <laughs> Don't pull a Sonata song on me. That's a good line. <laughs> Man, why are I guess answers always so boring? I, I think I think Makoto had way funnier answers. Like Dorian, do you know some of the funny answers you can pick in this game? <laughs> Wear a dachi. I think I think probably one of the like it's also like one of the most fucked up things. Like, um There's a there's a social link where um you get to hang out with like the this like elementary school girl and she says like why are my parents having a divorce and then makoto could say <laughs> because of you i know that one you know that one yeah he's like it's probably yeah. your fault <laughs> it's so <That's> fucked up <laughs> like i don't know why you can say all the fucked up shit so as makoto just fucking traumatize her yeah yeah that's like one of the most memorable ones Ooh, the man, Brett Amp. Oh, the man. He just got way better. Yeah. See, that's why he's the man, cause he can crit every time. Should say. And people who can crit are, uh, you know, very valuable, obviously. Okay. Okay. All right, let's go to the shop and buy some stuff. Oh yeah, my uh, my soul spinach is probably done. Welcome. The only time you'll catch me eating spinach. The shop can grow additional plants now. Now you're here. 
All right, what's up? We got magic talisman. Come to think of it. I love, I love how he just gives you random shit. He's like, oh hey, you did a few dungeons. Here's some random but BS. <laughs> he just hands out random bullshit. It's funny. Stuff you might find useful. The Maxima sniper. Hero bow. Oh yeah, I probably should be using this feature. Oh, but the can of treason gives me plus two stats though. Um. Yeah, supreme bow. Okay, that those might be a uh, good enough upgrade. Yeah, sell the old shit. The Arose Flamberge. Put the 30 SP though. Um. Okay, I can give this to Ken. To Ken Penders. Uh, this is only slightly better than what I have, and this may sucks. Alright. Well. Holy shit, I have half a million yen. What the fuck? How did I get half a million yen? That's crazy. I'm sure. I'm at your right. I'll take that. Move, alright, no, I'm sure. Uh, let's sell all this old stuff. I'm at your sure. I'm at your 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 Alright. It's a deal. Um. Sure. It's a deal. I don't need half of this stuff. I'll take that. Sure. It's a deal. Don't need the speed band anymore. Valor charm. This is fear. Nah, that's kind of nah. Um, survive dark or no survive dark. Auto supercage. The thing is, these these kind of sucks. They don't give uh, extra abilities. Yeah. What are you looking for? Null freeze. Uh, not bad. Wait, that's that's the status though. All stats plus one. Also, these, these, these accessories kind of these kind of suck. You finished? Be seeing you. All right, let's go to the antique shop. Cause that's where all the good stuff is. Yes, yes. Which one? You've come at a good time. There are some new items you can create. Bro, I can't even see- I can't even craft any of this crap. So, what will it be? The rune vest. Is that any good? Oh, well, for Junpei, that's probably good. No. There you go. Thanks for waiting. Oh, man, you got a new equipment. What would you like? Um... Oh, and something for Metis? Faster overheat recovery. Mmm. That is better than what she has, but she got but she's gonna lose the strike boost though. I don't wanna lose that. Oh wait. Oh this is good actually. Reduced physical damage. I actually really need that, honestly. Alright, can I get any can I get any cool cards? Uh besides growth too, not really. Got a suck dick, do 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 do. Uh, Maggie Dole Can't out gem. Never downloaded. I can also buy gems just straight up. Uh, I don't have any Dekaja gems. Just got a couple of those. And um, lower all foes' defense for three turns. Nah. And I'll get some chewing. I'll get a chewing soul. There we go. All good. Is that all you need? Oh. Again. Basically got my thing back. All right, let's let's stock up on a bunch of uh, items that we may or may not need. We've got some new stuff. Take your time, yeah, bro. Whole route. Restore 200 HP to all allies. I Do I have one that cures statuses for all allies? No. I got one of those. That might come in handy. I don't know. All right, I'm leaving. All right, we can uh, we can go save. 
Yeah, Alright, I'm back back to wearing my Foodney Velvet Room outfits. Yeah, I wonder if Metis got a new... Nope, no, uh... No new armors for her. Oh wow, look at, uh, look at all my strong personas that I got now. Yeah, I forgot to get rid of Dominion, actually. <laughs> yeah, let me, let, me, let me do that real quick. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Maybe Dominion can turn into something good, I don't know. Are you at please choose the persona um, you would like to fuse? Fuse it with fuse it to get to get the man who takes a shit. Hell yeah. Um Yeah, that's about all I can do. I'm just using you for fodder later and to free up space. So you can take your dump later. Alright, um, I can get Raphael. This would be a wise choice. I mean, Raphael's not bad. I do like that. Yeah, I can get four. I can't get four though. Is this acceptable? Oh, this guy's pretty good too. Actually, <laughs> yeah. Let's 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 get you. Um. So we're gonna get uh, a Tarakaja, um, Herculean Strike, and I guess we'll carry over growth one in uh actually not a growth one we'll carry over spirit drain just because i like that move it's food me well, well, well. technically there's an easy way to grind for sp in here and i can fuse you with suzaku to get uh kikurihime this persona is yeah why not skills to inherit. um well you also have mataru kaja <laughs> um growth three why not it's finally time i mean I'm, there's only like a few personas i'm gonna be using anyways so why not I'm gonna get more anyways. Four personas. Wow. I've never had that little. This would be a wise choice. The funny lion. Yep, that looks that looks good. Basically having like no coverage now, but who cares? We look I'm gonna get more personas anyway. Hmm, still no requests fulfilled either. All right, you know what? Let's take uh, let's take off um, Ken and put on Junpei because uh, Junpei is OP. There we go. Did I give Akihiko the right armor? Oh yeah, well he has Auto Tarukaja. Isn't he weak to um, Freeze though? Who is the guy who's weak to Freeze? Oh my god, I keep freaking forgetting which button it is. Here. Yeah, he is weak to freeze, so why don't I give him the thing that makes him immune to freeze? The sandals of trees and... And, um... Oh, he's already wearing the sandals of trees, okay. Um... What, you get? I'll give Ikari the sandals of trees and then... Unless there's someone else I couldn't give him to. Eh, why not? Save again. We're gonna go back to the Judgment Hall from Undertale. All right, let's get started. Yeah, this is gonna be the this is gonna be the physical squad. Hell yeah. That figure keeps just sending. Sh Oh, we're back to the, uh... We're back to the weird g b lean zone. Yeah, that's what we'll call it. We'll call it the lean zone. I, I still have Herculean Strike, right? 
I actually don't have Herculean Strike now. I have Deathbound. Well, I guess that's my bad for getting rid of it. Oh fuck, I wait to win? Are you are you serious, bro? What are the odds of that happening? Hey, I need no I need no win then. <laughs> Boom. That did decent damage. Oh, and Jinpei's weak to win too. This bad this lot out really sucks. At least Meta still has her Julian strike. Boom. Oh, nice crit. There we go. Do I have something that resists wind? Let's check. Um. Dodge fire. No, I, I just have dodge fire. That's it. I have wind boost. Does any of my personas no wind moves though? I guess Garu dying. <laughs> That's something. Oh, you also have it. Give it to you, I guess. Um, I give slash boost. Which persona is gonna use slash moves more often? Um. Hmm. I'll get rid of uh, Biaron for Slash Boost. There we go. Because I have my Biaron, you know, if I really need it. Salt Dive is not terrible. It's nice to have. Ooh, I see, uh, I see a Twilight Fragment. I want that. Hey, look, a shadow that I couldn't fucking see. Cool camera. You snap your fingers. Hey, why are you do I do rebelling. Can you do, like, revolution or something instead? Wind and Dark. I actually don't have Dark moves now, so... We're not gonna be able to take these guys down, anyways. Really? I can't use Slash? Mid. Well, I'm just gonna do this, then. To screw your elements. <laughs> What? How the fuck do you miss that? Well, now I don't have any way to take this guy down. Oh, I shocked him. Nice. Well, I guess I can do Garula. There we go. Yeah, it's time you actually hit. You don't miss. These guys are getting a little bit more annoying because they resist physical attacks. That certainly went well. Nice, Junpei leveled up. <laughs> Junpei is leveled up. Hmm, there's a chest. A sneaky chest. Very well hidden. Alright, it's time to get a first strike this time. Uh, don't know what the bird ups are weak to. Well, we know they're not weak to lightning. Did he get a crit? Dang, no crit. Boom. Dang, you resist. Uh, maybe they're weak to fire, I don't know. Luka, what are the birds weak to? Are they weak to pierce? Oh, hell yeah! What? How do you dodge, bro? Oh no, this is getting annoying. 
And you have myriad arrows. Oh god. Well, Junpei is gone. Oh, he's actually gone. What the fuck? Okay, not having a healer is actually kind of a bad idea. Now Akihiko's dead. Fuck. Can you stop targeting my weakness, bro? Can you stop fucking dodging, please? God damn. Yeah, you can do Tempest Slash. Dang, I did a lot. This is like one of the worst loadouts of all time. I don't have any piercing skills. Oh my god, it keeps dodging, bro. <laughs> I can't do anything. Somehow we're still living. Yeah, we got a crit, let's go. Yeah, I could've, I could've used that earlier. There we go, jeez. Yeah, d don't go into the abyss without um a healer. This is a bad idea. Oh no, it's not my fault that the enemies all resist physical. All of a sudden. Oh yes, I definitely need the Justice card. Alright, well, <laughs> let's heal up now. Yeah, we're done here. I'm done here. Ooh, gold guy. I want that gold guy. Wait, he's gone? What? I didn't even get to fucking see him. Well, that's lame. I don't know why they can just randomly disappear sometimes. <laughs> Evil touch, ooh. Nope. Yeah, you got a crit? Dang, no crit. Sad. Oh, now I guess got inflicted. Well, let's just try and kill them before this happens. Really? You dodge, bro? Sad. Yeah, get out of here. See, I mean, sometimes we still get shuffle time anyways. Get Atropos, and, uh, more experience. I mean, it's not like I'm under level, because, you know, I'm level 64 now. Damn. All right. Who's next? Oh, shit. What's down here? Filthy monster. Almost missed you again. Oh, they're weak to punch. And okay, maybe they're weak to lightning. Let's try. Nope, they block lightning. So maybe they're weak to wind then, I don't know. Oh ha, I heal. I'm just gonna lower the fence, whatever. Boom. Uh, let's try win. They are weak to win. Great. Well, we know their weakness now. That's good. Oh, 
Yeah, I remember the last encounter, that one was pretty piss easy. Uh, now yeah, I can get Siegfried again. <laughs> If I can get Herculean Strike back, that'd be nice. Nailed it. Nice going, June oh, that was a really easy floor. There we go. Gold guy, again. Okay, let's actually get him this time. Especially because he keeps running away. Um, I don't know what you're weak to. Let's try fisting him. Boom. Didn't Wait, do what? anything. <laughs> I go for the crit then instead. You're gonna make him a Muppet? Yes. <laughs> Yo, we got a crit. Let's go. Just dead ass killed them all in one turn. Oh, we got more XP. Yeah, you know, sure, we'll get Rongda for fusion fodder later. Yeah, the Egypt they got Maraku Kaja. No one can stop me and my sister. I got a free chest here. With uh speed incense. And a funny door. Okay, let me actually make sure to go in there this time. Where are my incenses at? Why are they here? That's not a weird place for them to be. Alright, put speed on Junpei. Put lock on Junpei. <laughs> Junpei's just gonna be like super OP now. Ooh, a Diaron skill card. Actually, I think I already have one of those. But I guess it can't hurt to have another one. The dice! Alright, are you weak to lightning? Yes! They die really fast now. I can get experience and Suzaku back. Doesn't look like we'll be needing a 10 count. Yo, Akihiko doesn't need takeout again. Hell yeah. Uh -huh. still, huh? And he got Masaku Kaja. Very nice. What does uh, Suzaku have again? Um, uh, oh, these skills. Rhonda. Has myriad arrows. Oh, we have a uh, we got a piercing skill now. Nice. And myriad arrows is good anyway. That looks like a strong oh, we got a tough lad. Yes. Oh, is it gonna be the fucking minotaur again though? I don't want to fight that asshole. The minotaur was annoying. Plus, I don't have almighty skills now. Alright, let's, uh... Oh, huh. Now I realize Mitsuru hasn't been leveled up in a while. Crazy. <laughs> sure, I guess we'll bring Mitsuru and Ken with us. Welcome back. Yeah, yeah. that clock was good. Makes sense to bring them. Hello. Uh, yeah, I haven't brought Mitsuru in a while. Yeah, you haven't. Where did I saw it? Well, bye, bye, uh, Junpei. It was fun using you for a few battles. So, how far you know? Uh, I'm like very close to finishing the fifth door. Oh, but I think Jesus. Yeah, I mean, I started it this episode. That's just gonna be my goal, is to try and finish it this episode. Yeah, I came in earlier. Yeah, and then you went to go jack right. off. <laughs> continue yeah, because because I realized that my headset wasn't connected. Oh, well, I shit. Was on, I was focused. Uh, can, can you? Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I just want to 
Um, not bad. Um, and I was waiting for anything to all the way to Elmer. Don't again. <laughs> yeah, so maybe next time you can play in a Sang Harley with us. Yeah. Yeah, we're planning to do this in a days again. Yeah, even though it's almost never on Monday. <laughs> Yeah, it's always on like a Friday or Saturday. Yeah. Nope. Can't, can't confuse me. Alright, uh, weak to ice? Nope. Maybe they're weak to fire? I don't know. Yo, he's weak to fire. Oh my god. I forgot I have weakness amp. Nice. Oh, finally, Mr. will learn a good move. And, uh, nah, don't need a freeze boost. But I do want Bufu to die, that's good. Oh, and she's gonna learn, uh... She's gonna learn... Another good move. Zeodyne! And, nah, you don't need lightning. Okay, <laughs> Akahiko's the lightning guy, not you, Ken. Don't worry, sister. He was the lightning guy to begin with. Yeah, he was always lightning guy. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know why Ken learns both lightning and light moves. It's really weird. Yeah, it's kind of. Like he's the he's like the only uh, persona user to do that. My sensitivity shit. Okay, well, I guess, I guess Meta's done now. Yeah. Ooh, regenerate too. Not too well, if you ask me, Metis is mostly a physical user now. Nice. That went well. She just has a bit of coverage for extra damage, I guess. But once he learns, like, some really good like moves, to I'm gonna be taking that off of her. Is this gonna be the frickin' Minotaur again? Cause I don't wanna fight him. Oh hey look, a teleporter, nice. I definitely wanna save as much as possible. You never know when some dumb bullshit's gonna happen, I'll die in one hit. That's just the whole thing of the answer, you know? Random BS that can kill you. Yeah, that's like every game. Okay, crit? No crits? Alright, but now Mitsuru has a good move, so we can do Nero Slash. And she got a crit, which is great. Yeah. Do it again. Yeah. Do it again. Boom. And we can get, uh, max SP up by 7, and we can get the Toilet Man again. But I want experience, so... Yeah. Oh, you got Omri to shower. I already have Omri to shower, though. I mean, I guess I don't need Augudine. Yeah. A victory well earned. Oh, I got, like, an Omri to soda. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna go find the exit first, and then I'll go to the teleporter. It looks like we well, speaking of the exit, there it is. And what do we have over here? Okay. We're gonna go save real quick. We are 17 hours into this game. Jesus. I guess I guess maybe the answer is thirty hours after all. Oh, and a gold guy. I came I come back and there's a gold guy here now. Oh wait, I never explored. Oh wait, there's a door here. Oh fuck, I didn't go there. Man, I keep like missing those Don't doors worry, now. <laughs> I'm right behind you. It seems like we've checked everything on the Eh, who needs it anyways? I'm strong enough as is. 
Get a crit, maybe? <laughs> this is gonna be the whole thing of the answer. It's like, can I get a crit? Let's find out. Boom. Ooh, I confused them. Let's go. Man, for a thing called the Mind Dice, you sure get minded a lot. Boom. Alright, fist the dice. Dead. I don't know how you would fist a dice. Oh, yeah, I can get thrown back. Ooh, invigorate too. I can put invigorate on more of my personas. Get back here. Gold guy. Yeah, Persona. Um. Oh, Ken's out of S. Ken's out of HP. Okay, let me heal up then. All right. Um. Yeah, I'll just do Nero Slash. Oh, wait, there's two different kinds of dice here. Didn't even realize. Maybe you get a crit. Boom. Yeah. Do it again. Boom. Man, that's satisfying. I wonder if physical was this OP in uh, Persona 5 as well. Because if it was, man, I, I'm not sure why I didn't use it more often. No one can stop me and my sister. All right, let's go to the next floor. Guess I missed out on the freaking Monad doors again. I trust you're not tired. Then let's be off. <laughs> yeah, I'm not tired. I'm good. It's kind of nice getting to move around this much again. I've basically been doing nothing but studying lately. It made me feel stiff. Yeah, you're gonna be a shut-in, like Futaba. <laughs> you don't want to be like Futaba. Do you put the Futa in Futaba? Mm, preferably not. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Keep it together. I'm going to hell. Average persona, every average Reddit persona user. Ooh. Oh. Slash at it. <laughs> oh yeah, we got another crit. Let's go. How much crit did you get this time? A lot. I lost track. <laughs> so that's a good sign. Oh wow, that is good. See, I went from getting like no crits in like episode one, and now we're getting like a shit ton of them. Auto Tarukaja. Those are always nice to have. Mission complete. Mission complete. All right. Yeah, nothing else on this floor. Yeah, some more stuff. A bit uneasy. Yeah, so for clearing a path, it's here. You barely cleared out this floor at all. I heard Sonata saw Nutter. The only thing I got out of this is that there's four different places I can go. Let me guess, you're immune to light? Actually, no, you're not. Okay. Interesting. Oh, they're weak to ice! Interesting. Thought I told you to sit down and stop acting up like a little bitch. I'm Lotus Juice. I have two different dice enemies on uh, in this like dungeon. I think that's a bit overkill. Oh hell yeah, we can get Trumpeter, one of the best personas of all time. All right, bye throne. Yeah, I'm definitely leveling up Trumpeter. We can finally get Debilitate, one of the best skills of all time. And we learn Moragidine, so we can get rid of uh, Augidine for that. 
All right. Uh, do I have? I have a growth two skill card still, so put that on trumpeter immediately. Yep. The dupe god, as I call him. <laughs> um, you know what? Let's put Auto Taru on him as well. I'm definitely leveling him up. Trumpeter is a staple in all of my playthroughs. I'm not sure why. Maybe it's because of how great he was in Persona 4. It just had a lasting impact on me. At like last like last impact. It's the funny sand guy. Ooh. I guess son. Oh, did I just get another crit? Let's go. Yeah. Get another one. Dang it. Get a crit, come on. Please? Nah. Okay, uh, try again. Oh fuck, they're immune to punch. Shit. Um, alright, now just go, just, just kill them with the wind then. How ironic, a fire guy is using a wind move. <laughs> I don't know why I ended up with Garudine on him, but I ain't complaining. It's more coverage. Oh, get Jakayu again. Wait, that's Suzaku, not Jakayu. Well, I already leveled up to Suzaku. Ooh, concentrate and get rid of uh, Ice Break. Because who the fuck uses that? Happy to team up with like if you ask me, if you're if you're using ice break, then that just means you have a shit um a shit like strategy for the boss. The iron dice. I mean, I'm just gonna use I'm just gonna crit them again. <laughs> Actually, uh, we'll leave my buffalo to be safe. Nice. And then do Nero slash immediately after. Oh, they resist. Shock and punch. Dang it, why do you resist all my physicals? Oh, they're dead. Even with their resisting. Alright, now he- I guess has 10 HP left, oh my god. It's like nothing. I know he came over to you. Well, if I didn't heal, yeah, I would've game over. It's like- like- it's like they say in Super Paper Mario, your games will be over. That's our way um... What is over on the- what is in that one pathway? Maybe by the seventh door, I'll see if I can take on the Reaper. Look, York went to go jack off. Oh, and he went to go jack off. Rip. Everybody has a theory now. Get a crit. Dang. Well, it doesn't matter. They're gonna, they're gonna die anyways. Yo, let's go. Boom. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm so glad I have that strike boost on meta still. Oh, the fool and experience. You never go with with more experience. Now then, let's get back to. Yeah, get back to work. Then there's no time to waste. <laughs> Could it be? Oh, we got the funny shadow. Why is he so greedy, huh? Alright, let me open up my soundboard again. By the way. You know what? Let's just uh 
We'll speed run this. No! Okay. Butter, I don't care about you anyways. Oh, hey, there's a teleporter here. You know, that means more saving. We have to get being close. We're on 424 now. I trust you're not tired. All right, 425. Hey, we made it. We made it to the bottom. Nice. <laughs> All right, now I get another another cutscene. Oh, damn. This is Tartarus from the inside. Wow, it's funny seeing Tartarus now. <laughs> Even though I've already been it. This is only the second time anyone has come here without special equipment. Oh. Normal weaponry is useless against shadows. Anything you've brought provides little more than peace of mind. Everyone here has had their potential developed in our labs. That alone should suffice for protection. Though... Should you get devoured, that would provide us with valuable data as well. <laughs> Bro's gonna sack his party members. What is this bro yapping about? <laughs> In any case, sir, are you all right with this? I mean, with bringing your daughter here. My fa my favorite character, stern-faced bodyguard. <laughs> I don't mind at all. I myself requested to come along. Oh yeah, that's Mitsuru, by the way. <laughs> In case it wasn't obvious. You heard her. Uh, my apologies, sir. I overstepped. <clears throat> hey, what's wrong? Uh, I think he thinks someone really has to use the bathroom. Oh, okay. What the? Bro became a shadow somehow. Uh, uh, it appears we need to conduct further research in artificially developing the potential. Both of you, stand back. So that's a shadow. Yeah, use your use your piercing skills. That'll do the trick. You Oh, he gone. Sir, miss. Father! Oh, damn. Did you see that? Incredible. Absolutely incredible. Oh, such power. It's a persona. I was right. People can use them! Mitsuru! Father... I'm glad... you're safe. Oh, that was wonderful, Miss Mitsuru! Of course, you would be the first one to awaken your potential naturally. With this, the future truly does seem bright. Why the hell are you celebrating? Now Mitsuru will be condemned to a life of atonement. She'll spend her prime years bound to our vile legacy. Can you call that bright? Don't worry, Father. This is what I wanted. I will protect you. Mitsuru. I didn't realize she awakened to her persona that early. Yeah, 0.46% achievement. Guys, I'm getting all the rare achievements today. Wow. Hmm? Oh, yes. Oh. Senpai? What's the matter? I'm sorry. It's, it's just that seeing my father as if he were still alive. It's... Senpai. 
wasn't Kirito Senpai just so gosh darn cute when she was younger? <sighs> Excuse me, Iori. Are you saying that's no longer the case? Uh oh, <laughs> bro's gonna get executed. Yeah, no, that's not what I. I, I mean, you, you're just so. It's you more. No, oh, come on, cut a guy some slack here. <laughs> Is that so? So the answer takes place after Persona that's 3, right? Yeah, it does. Of the past events we've the fits are hard. <laughs> So we said, well, it's weird because, like, the answer is full of memories that take place before Persona 3, and we're playing the events of after Persona 3. Wait, the answer is a real game? Yeah. I thought my friends were making a joke. No. <laughs> See, my friends were saying, oh, friends are the answer. I'm going to just try Googling and I couldn't find it. <laughs> the answer. Yeah, well, it's, a, it's an expansion of Persona 3, that's why. Don't you all get that feeling too? It's been more when At least, jack off. a little bit? Wow, Sam just really had to go back to the jacking off, man. What the hell? Just a little bit, yes. We've reached the fifth door now. We should be getting closer to the source. The source? I just remembered. <laughs> Isn't that a place where I can get, like, phones at? <laughs> Remember the equipment and documents Kirijo Senpai found? I looked into them. And it turns out they were things that the chairman hid when he was still alive. Most of them were from the accident about ten years ago. He must have hidden them to keep them from being destroyed. And some of the notes seem to mention the abyss of time. Oh wow, how convenient. They do? It won't be long before we discover what this place really is. Yeah, I mean, we just have door six, door seven, and then whatever the hell happens after that. Feels like we're closing in on the truth. Then we should press on. Akihiko and Doggy. Sorry. Well done. <laughs> Three hours later, after Akihiko finished his training. Man, it's so weird, these aren't voiced. I guess even the answer was a little bit rushed. No. Alright, now Akihiko learns... Severe electric damage to one foe. Which is okay, it's not the worst thing. Koromaru, on the other hand, learns a really good skill. Next, it was just basically... Oh yeah, Koromaru's the one that learns chow, uh, charge for everybody. <laughs> chow. I mean, maybe that's what we should call it. We should call it chowling, where you charge and howl at the same time. It's weird, because normally- when you get Koromaru normally, he already comes with both of his Theurgies. It's weird that you have to unlock them again. By the way. Yeah. Yes, exactly. Only two doors, which means we'll do door number six next episode, I guess. And, uh, I probably don't need to go shopping, like, unless I have some antiques that I need, but, yeah. Oh, let's hang out with Yukari. This non-fiction novel. I see. Uh, <laughs> it's a shoujo manga. Oh. <laughs> I mean, I prefer, you know, I prefer Sailor Moon, honestly. <laughs> hey, so. Um... Uh, 
<laughs> Why is your car looking at me like that? <laughs> You can join me anytime. <laughs> huh? Alright, so Yukari gets... Healing Apex. Reduces SP of recovery to 25%. Yeah, Yukari basically just has free healing now. <laughs> Do we have to? Alright, well that's good. Maybe I should bring Yukari then, instead of Ken, because Yukari is just a better healer. Uh, yeah, I guess we'll... Maybe confuse some Personers, and then call it a day. Because we got a lot of progress done. We got an entire door done in one episode. Like, you know, I like to do that. More Twilight Fragments. Alright, am I high enough level to Register use more stuff? Oh, this level is lower than it was previously. Oh, that's why you don't want to do it. Okay. Oh! Yeah, I can fuse Suzanowo. I need Clotho to get Norn. I need Byako. Incubus. Ugh. Shall we take a look? I can get uh, Thor. This Hell yeah, is what you wish Thor is great. Just get, just get, uh, just put all the growth cards on him. Well then, shall we begin? I'll level him up quickly. All right, so we got Thor now from freaking, you know, the Thor. <laughs> the wait, no, that's Wolverine, not Thor. Yeah, Thor and Deadpool, my favorite movie. Boron Um Parvati and Chernobog for Garuda. Sure. To Carry over uh, Tempest Slash and the Growth Cards. And Apt Pupil. Doubles the chance of a crit. Hell yeah. So of course I want that. Look, you are. And we can get, uh, Baron. This persona, please choose what skills to inherit. Uh, carry over Bufudine, the Diorama, and Grow 3, because why not? Well, well, Grow 3, this is amazing. This sure is amazing. <laughs> And who else can I get? I can get Kali. Um, I can get rid of Ranga and Garuda. This would be a lot. Please choose. Of course, I want this persona, dude. Um, Matarunda. Oh, of course, I get Apt Pupil. That's a necessity. Jacob, did you play this game yesterday? Uh, yes, I did. I played it in the morning. Okay. You know, let's go with Counter Strike. Hell yeah. Now I have one of the most overpowered personas. Nice. I mean, having a heat mean, wave is fucking great. I mean, nice. Which will you choose? Um. Oh, that's level 67. Dang. Well, I can get. Be, I can get Biako though. I think I, I, think I need Biako for something. Um, charge. Sure. Well, well, well. We have a funny lion. Yep, this looks like a good, uh, good set of personas. Can I, I can get Raphael. You know what? Yeah. Let's get Raphael. Let's carry over, uh, Maragidine. Um, Garudine, um, 
auto Mataru and grow three. It's finally time. There we go. I mean, I need Raphael later anyways for another persona, so I might as well fuse him. There we go, that looks good. Good, good personas now. Well, then. Shall I mean, take a look? I can also make Seth. This would be a wise choice. Seth is pretty good. Maybe later. Are you finished? What happened? We look. All right, I think I'm done making personas. Personas, yeah. Yep, personas. All right. Um, I think we'll probably call it a day. Then I made a lot of progress. Yeah, even though we'll be made. I got I got the fifth door done, so we're gonna do door number six next time. Um, I missed it. Well, well. Yeah, that's what you get for jacking off, bro. <laughs> <laughs> My mom needed me, dude. Oh, fair enough. All right. Well, um. I kind of needed him. Yep. All right. Well, um, newer Super Mario Bros. Wii tonight, hopefully. Yeah. So. Oh, you didn't yeah. do it last night. I could. My internet was dead. Oh, no. But hopefully, as long as it doesn't go out again, then I can uh, do it tonight. So, yeah. Alright, well, uh, I'll see you guys later then, alright? Bye, buddy. Yeah, see you Bye. guys. Went to go jack off. Alright, guys, well, thanks for watching uh, Persona 3 The Answer. We had a lot of people join today. I guess that's because it's a Saturday. Makes sense. But anyways, uh, make sure to like and subscribe on YouTube and Twitch as always. And uh, yeah, new soup tonight. See you guys then.